Hi guys, welcome back to Red Dog Gaming, where we are continuing our Let's Play as Parthia in Rome Total War Remastered. Uh, we are getting very close to the end now. We have absolutely savaged the Scipii the last couple of turns. Um, and in fact, what we're going to do is have a quick look at the uh, faction ranking scroll. Oh, look at that dip. Uh, we'll remove ourselves. Uh, yeah, Bruti are dead. What about the Julii? And we will go military ranking. Oh my god. That is all because of us. That is huge. Production ranking, of course, down. Territorial. So the Julii do have a, probably about 10 settlements. Skippy, I, I don't know what that is. Probably five. Um, and three of them are right here. So, I'm going to get going. I'm not going to worry about Numidia too much. I'm, in fact, going to recruit as many horse ar archers as I can there. We have enough money. <laughs> we have over a million now in cash. Uh, we'll get some sap points and ladders. Do we have... Yeah, we've got archers, but I'm assuming that is mainly infantry. No catapults in this army. Uh, now, you should be able to take Carthage in one go if we do that. We wiped out a lot of Skippy Eye armies. Right, next... Next job. Getting you guys out of here. Um, you are in low. Details. Monthly races? Yeah, that makes them happy. Not, We don't need to worry about money anymore, so putting races on. Ooh. Hello. They might sally out at us, which would be amazing for us. Look at this, this navy. It's brutal. Uh, do we have a navy? Yeah, we have a navy over here to ship these armies, but it's not ship very ready. strong. You go in there. Who are you? Oh, you're going to die, aren't you? I'm surprised we didn't sink any ships there. And you're going to come back over. You can stay there. Right, you're moving there. We are going to try and take Carthage. Ah, yes. Lucius the Cruel. He has a one ballista, 18 incendiary pigs. So we're just going to worry about the elephants a little bit. But I don't think we'll need the elephants. Our horse archers should be more than capable of destroying these guys. The one thing we've got to worry about here, though, is them withdrawing. If they withdraw, that creates the siege. So I think before we charge our cavalry forward, we'll wait for them to join up. Or at least come into the battle enough to... You know, be far enough away that if they do withdraw, we'll smash them anyway. Lucius the Cruel. We will kill you and your cruel ways. And bring the joy and enlightenment of Parthian wisdom to you. The wisdom to use horse archers at nearly every single opportunity. <laughs> and elephants. Elephants, of course. Fantastic units. Um, and we have seen how OP they've been in the last couple of episodes. Um, so guys, I have been thinking, yes, a dangerous thought, uh, I'm sure. Um, this this forest is annoying, I hate forests. Um, you guys back, I believe he will be coming in from the right. Ah, this corner, I'm guessing. That's where the settlement is. So we should set up over here really cataphracts in general you guys can come here with the elephants don't think any of these guys can hide <laughs> they are too big there's all the horse archers right the enemy have brought up more men you guys actually get out of there just because you might be a little bit close the secondary army's smaller where are you i can't even see them inside the forest there um, so we probably will go and harass the bigger army. Let's wait for these guys to come out a bit. Yes, I've been thinking, guys. And, um, and what we're going to do... So, obviously, we're not going to finish the campaign with full map completion. That's never been the goal, really. I guess we might have mentioned it at some point, but... 
yes, I believe never really had a set goal of format completion, but what we're going to do, we're going to finish officially the campaign. We need to keep that on so we can actually see what's going on. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to do a live stream where we go to format completion, however long it takes. It'll take a few hours, so that's why we'll do a live stream, but that's where we'll go. We'll go all the way to format completion uh, when we finish the campaign. And we are on episode 28, 29, and I kind of want to finish on episode 30 just because, okay, they're, they're withdrawing. They're already withdrawing. Yeah, that is really annoying. Uh, we could do without that, to be honest. Um, these guys are withdrawing as well. So they're going to withdraw within the city. Ah, my guys are too slow because they're not fast moving. Come on, guys. How are they withdrawing already? Like, they sh they stood and fought. Like, that is annoying. Why would you do that? Come on, guys. Not far away from... Uh, get into them. We might break a few of these boys. Yep. These guys are really good in melee, so... Can't be too worried about using them. Triaria out. Continue. Yeah, we did lose a lot of horses there. Maybe I should have done that. Especially on six times speed, but who cares? Uh, right, just get in there. Apart from you guys, get into this unit. Oh, it's dead. Oh, well. Oh, well, at least we wiped out one army. They did kill eight, uh, 89. Lucius the Cruel only has 231 troops. That's why he fled. But why would he stand and fight then? He sh they should have just withdrawn anyway. But I guess that means we can siege down Carthage and hopefully take it in the next turn. They don't have a... Uh, this guy's dead. I, yeah, adoption not completed. He's dead. <laughs> um, ah, the annoying thing is we're not going to be able... We could probably break down the gates. Uh, we'll try and break down the gates. But that will be annoying, having to deal with that. Now, up here, anyone else need retraining? Just you guys, which we don't need to bother with that. Sire. Sire. Prepare for battle. Attack. How Victory is this is balance of power not hugely in our favor? I guess we'll have to fight it then, just because if we press auto-resolve, I'm afraid we'll lose a load of elephants, which... We can afford to do, but we can't really afford it that much. Um, we might even send some elephants over from Sardis if we can. Uh, just to keep those elephants topped up and ready to fight. Um, they are OP as hell. Um, I have another video, guys, out uh, ranking every every faction in Rome Total War. So please do check it out. Uh, Parthia is one of my favorite factions, but... It's ranking wasn't that high because there are certain things with Parthia that don't allow it to be a really top tier faction. The start's reasonably difficult. Um, first of all, just one cataphracta. Two units of these guys. We fire at will to start with, but I don't think that's going to matter. Where are they? Oh, hello. You want to stand opposite my elephants? Like, okay. We might get to kill a uh, general here, which will be fun. Um, and I've also done a few other ranking videos. So we've ranked all the Roman units, which is relevant because we'll be playing Scipi very soon. I can't wait for that. That's going to be fun. There's two Roman generals here that are going to die, which is excellent for us. Oh, we had a bit of high ground advantage there. Uh, they are... Oh, that general's running. I hope he doesn't run. There we are. That's, that's that one dead. Ah, the other one got away, though, which is really annoying. Uh, but, yeah. So, we're going to do a live stream to try and do World Conquest, which... 
take a few hours, probably three hours, four hours, depending on what's going on. Um, I'm also not really going to worry about rebelling settlements if we do that. So this army is absolute trash. I are not going to be able to siege it down very quickly. Nine turns as well. Although they are, looks like they have five peasants and then some cavalry. What are they? Rebel general. Ooh, rebel general. A general in there is annoying, but not much else we can do about it. Uh, right. Adaminum. Oh, Aretium. How unhappy are you, Aretium, right now? Oh, Jesus. Oh! Very unhappy. <laughs> uh, daily races that does only take them up to that wow get as many peasants as you can still only at 30 what buildings do we have here we built the temple we'll keep building another temple uh, because I've reloaded the game in uh, it means our construction browser is no longer available from last time so, this is my details. Yeah, we'll get to daily races and we'll get a few more. Mighty general. Come up here. Don't believe the Julia will have a lot. They'll have probably a few settlements out here, but as I say, we're not going to fully destroy them before we end the campaign. We're just going to take the whole of the Italian peninsula. Um, and then, do we take Corsica and Sardinia? I don't know. Uh, but obviously, we want to take Carthage and Thapsus because they are basically the main Scipii settlements right now. Um, and then when we've taken that, we are basically done apart from our world conquest. Right. Here. Can't get a peasant. How about... Oh, they're very unhappy here as well. Get two of you guys. You back in, General? How are you so unhappy? 70%. That's fine. That's all we need. Uh, right. Oh, my God. We have so many armies. This is crazy. Uh, you're obviously taking Aquincum. Which we should be able to take this turn, actually. You're going to fight them. Not that it really is going to help. Because I believe we'll be gone by the time we're dead. We will be deaded by the time that happens. Right, you, you can reach Vicus Gothi quicker, so we'll get you up there. Oh, mm, we have been ambushed by this trash army. Chosen Axemen are good. But they do have Chosen Archer Warband, who are probably the best archers in the game. War dogs, which are annoying. This is really quite a beaten army. It's not a great army. But we still should be fine. Surprised they didn't manage to get that ambush off on us. Like The Germanians are good ambushers. Um, and generally their, their generals have good ambushing traits. But... Looks like they failed. Can't ambush the horse archers, bro. The horse archers are too quick for you. Unless it is an ambush. I was going to say, is that the game starting right away? Okay, yep. Standard tactic. One left. One right. Hate that forest. Really annoying. I hate fighting in forests. General back here with the poor infantry. Guys, get here. These guys don't have the long-range missiles, but they uh, are fast-moving, so that's the uh, good part about it. You guys come close as well. Uh, will we have enough arrows to kill all these guys? I, I believe so. I believe so. But yeah, if we can take a few more of these settlements up here in the north as well, that does make the uh, world conquest a lot easier. So... Makes it a lot faster, should I say. Dealing with these uh, factions one by one. Yeah, double speed. Chosen Axemen should be falling. Great. Uh, yep, they, know, they don't really know what to do. As usual with the AI. Guys get a bit 
closer. They perceive this side as stronger because it has more men in it, which is true. Uh, someone's going to set the war dogs off very soon. Uh, yeah, the war dogs are coming and the horsemen. Right, get off that. Let's go back as far as we can. Yeah, the war hounds, they're just annoying. They're generally really, really annoying. I hate them. You're fast. Who are you? Chosen Axeman. You are very fast. You also don't have a proper general in this unit. Okay, one of the uh, horse archers dead because of the warhounds. That is how annoying they are. Like, there's so many of them as well. Uh, do you know what? Get behind here and hopefully they charge into our infantry. Like our hoplites or something. Hoplites, if you want to say it in the Greek fashion. Yeah, they should, actually. I uh, don't want you to get killed. You guys get there. Come across. Someone's charging. Who's charging? Good I left you on skirmish mode. The Warhounds, they're just going after one unit. Like, what are you doing, Warhounds? Kill those warhounds, please. The p ah, it's so annoying. They uh, are they withdrawing? No, they're charging more. Like, who are you? Hoplites. Like, okay. Eastern infantry is breaking them right now, which is shocking. Shocking morale from them. Let's come up. Yeah, these infantry now broken. Okay, uh, Hoplites, you all go. I mean, running into that is not a great uh, look for you guys. You could probably come and uh, charge these guys. Glad I set you on um, skirmish mode, but run through those chosen archers now. Get to here. Uh, the Warhounds, they just target one unit as well. Where's me, General? Get in there. Oh, the Hoplites broke. Which is embarrassing. Wondered why it was going so fast. It's on double speed, isn't it? <laughs> Classic. Who are you? Warhounds retreating. Get over that side. I say everyone's moving quick, but Axeman, Axeman, you should chew through these guys for fun, especially seeing as they're counter charging. Yeah, you chose an archer warband, you should chew through those guys for fun as well. He's dead. Is there any point in killing him? The enemy general oh, that's everyone basically. Kill the screeching women, and what are you? How many? Uh, we need to kill a few more. Look at the Warhounds still going. We're going to lose troops to the Warhounds. That's so annoying. These guys should deal with them. Speed up. Have we got enough? Yes, we do. Fantastic. Hey, 297. Oh, I guess... Uh... Oh, that's theirs. Uh... Yeah, 297 Hoplites and the Eastern Infantry was a huge portion of that. And then the rest of them was the Warhounds, most likely. Warhounds, oh, just so, so annoying. Unbelievably annoying. You can't deal with them properly. And then when you try and target them... Right, we're going to have to properly get an army with it once this is done. Merge all these guys and try and recruit some more horse archers. Right. What do you have? Some axemen, some spearmen. Oh, that should be nice. This uh, this army. Yeah. This is the proper army in this area. These guys have never seen elephants before. Welcome to elephant hell, my brother. I was thinking about why Rome was so successful at the time. And why it's so loved today by lots of people. 
including you guys, I'm guessing, who are watching this. But I generally think the time period and the area, there's so much variety in culture. Um, warrior styles. Like, we have the Parthians here fighting against the Germans. Like, it's basically polar opposites in terms of how they would fight uh, and their war tactics. So, yes, it is. Where are, now, where are their reinforcements? Because we need to be able to see them, really. They should be coming from back here. Are they delayed? Oh, no, they're coming. I just don't want them to withdraw. We have more troops, but, of course, the balance of power is in our favor. Do you know what? We need half the army over here. Elephanticles will bring you forward, because we will use you. Just for fun. Just for a bit of funsies. Uh, they do have a warlord, and it looks like the faction heir. So. Uh, what happens if we charge elephants into spear warband, I wonder? Probably a great number of casualties on the enemy side, of course. Not ours. I don't, I've never really liked Cantabrian Circle that much. I don't know why. I don't think it's that powerful. So spears apparently can spook elephants, but don't really see it, you know, very often. Back a bit. Barbarian Warlord isn't fast moving, so we should have a good time against it. They are starting to fall now. Yes, well, let's see what happens. Surely they're going to break. They're eager. You fools. Oh, they know. They they do well. They killed the elephants. Get out. Get out. They killed a few of the elephants. Oh, no. One's gone mad already. They both gone mad. Oh, no. Are they routing or they gone mad? No, they're routing. Fools. That actually works. Those phalanx works against the elephants. I've never seen that before. That spear warband as well. The trashiest phalanx. In the game, really? Well, no, militia, militia hoplites. When they get close, we'll, we'll rally the troops. We are being a bit rushy. But, as I say, we're pushing through this campaign now. There's nothing for us to really worry about. Right, elephants, get out. I think you were the first casualties we took, though, so you shouldn't have too much... Uh, casualties to stay. You should heal a few. A few necromancers. Get into them. Get into them. Oh, they're withdrawing. That's so annoying. Because I can't charge those guys, really. Right, the, uh, the generals. So we're not going to. Oh, he's dead! Oh! We're not going to kill enough, though. We're genuinely not going to kill enough to take the settlement. So annoying. We've, we've, we've failed twice to do this right now. Spear warband. Not. Probably will break because the general's dead. I'm glad they just... Um, they should break now. Yeah, broken. Good. Go across there if you can those boys you guys keep coming up breaking them all really I just walk run that way and I think they'll break from overwhelming numbers They're already shaken yeah, wavering yep they all flee get into those guys get there so, overwhelming numbers works pretty well uh, when you uh, have a morale advantage. So, in case you don't know, if the enemy thinks there's a lot more numbers around them, you can see them wavering now, and they'll probably break with the combined pressure of the arrows that are getting absolutely hammered into them. We should probably get our troops away, actually, from those guys, because... Um, we are doing a lot of friendly fire, I guess, with that. Yeah, you can see the friendly fire we've done. Speed it up a bit. Wow, I couldn't believe 
But those elephants took that much damage. How many was it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. From one spear warband. Shoot them to death. That's the other general. Well, there we are. 27. Wow. But we actually killed a lot due to friendly fire, so... 27, add that, 58. So we lost uh, 20 to, to friendly fire. Not too bad. Elephants. Okay, yeah, 6 and 2. That's good casualty recovery rate for those elephants. Fantastic. I love it. Uh, but yes, we don't want to be charging our elephants into spear warband then. It's very annoying. And we didn't quite have enough um, to take the city as well. No, it's just two spear warband. That's it. That's fine. Thing is now, when we're coming north with these guys, we'll be able to link up. Oh, you can go here. Yeah. So many armies. Redonkulous. Right, let's get building. Doesn't matter what you build there. Uh, yeah, whatever. Seed on that. Bostra, nope. Petra, Alexandria. No law, please. Memphis. Uh, Shipwright. Damata is still a town, which is embarrassing. Thessalonica, let's go for that. Domus, Dulcis, Domus. These places that are still towns, it just shows you like there's no chance you're getting all your places upgraded by the end of the game. Because we've already achieved victory conditions and we still have regular towns that we took a long time ago. It probably exterminated everyone, but oh well. Adaminum, get them happy please. Syracuse, get them happy. Salona can't even make them happy, but they do have 70% though. Although, Shrine to Artemis. Oh, maybe that was why we're keeping there, because it upgrades their missile weapons. Oh well, we've moved them now. Yeah, enemy army wraps, cool. And the turn, Spy, you keep moving. Doesn't look like, ooh, Aretium's rioting. Brilliant. Ah, oh well, oh, okay. Uh, well, yeah. That's just a trash up. Oh! 222! That shows you how broken auto resolve is. Those peasants would not inflict 222 casualties. If, oh, what? What's he doing? This is the weird thing about having um, horse archer armies. Everyone thinks they can beat you because it's a low amount of troops for the amount of units you have in your army. For the amount of like unit cards, you mean? Um, I mean, in, in your army. So everyone thinks, wow, we can beat you. We're going to smash you. Uh, like this, but this army, like, as, there is literally zero chance beating this other army. Like, if you were playing as the other army and you're the greatest Rome Total War player of all time, I don't believe you will, you would be able to beat this army unless the AI was so incompetent they practically did absolutely nothing to combat you. Like, look at this army. You think this horde of horses is going to lose to this? You have a general? Oh, wow. So do we. And our general's probably better than yours. No offense, bro. We need to get them, like, as tight as they can be. Do you know what? And you guys come off this way. Stick you there. So that we've got the separation. Let's get out there. Let's get there. Uh, it's not very... Oh, who's... I guess that's friendly fire that's just killed a load of our own horses. I don't get the friendly fire. Like, who are they not firing up in the air with their arrows? Are they firing directly at the, their, their own friends' heads? I, I don't get it. I guess they are firing in a low arc in a lot of cases. Get towards that general. He's probably going to charge us, but we need to kill him to kill this army. 
up there, guys. Oh, what are these? Okay, they do have archers, so I'm guessing they've shot our archers. So maybe come across this way a bit more. That general is getting a bit tasty. But let's come around. They're probably going to try and withdraw at some point, but they are very much surrounded. No elephants in this army, unfortunately. But these elephants would make mincemeat of these guys. <laughs> like, I thought they would make mincemeat of Spear Warband, though, and... Uh, yeah, that was interesting, wasn't it? Uh, the Archer Warband, I believe we should probably just try and... Uh, yeah, we are, we're been fully surrounded right now. The Archers are just running around and they're, they're not really doing anything. Alright, stop firing, guys. You guys also stop firing. Uh, can you do that, please? Absolutely slaughter them. Nice one. Well done, guys. Fantastic. 22. They killed. We killed a lot more. But yeah, it's interesting to know. I don't believe we have a single unit that has a gold experience yet. But I think that's mainly because we have been just Let us end this savaging... I'm going to get a ceasefire with you guys because I just don't want to deal with you on my southern border. Regretfully, be quick. Right, what about ceasefire, is map information, and I'll give you, like, 50,000. This isn't really going to help the AI that much. Oh, it's very, very generous. Um, because they don't really know how to use the money very well. On top of that, they still have the same... Hmm. Uh, very well. They still have the same, oh, they're sallying out, um, ability to just recruit one unit at a time. Okay, this is trash. Oh, oh dear, but this is absolute trash as well. It's sad. Okay, one, two, three peasants, an archer, two archers actually, is that better than our slingers? Two javelin men, we're just going to have to use our cavalry really well. And they have two rebel generals, which is a bit OP. Is that Rebel General? If that charges us, if they charge us, we have no spearmen. Um, like, that's, that's just going to shred through our army. Like, if I was them, I would just charge our infantry and our archers and all that. And our slingers. And shred our own army to, uh, shred our army to pieces. If I was them, but they won't do that, hopefully. Uh, we'll try to use the camel archers to kill as many as we can, but the camel archers are trash. They're so slow. Camels, man. Look at them here, taunting us in this artwork. They are shit. Why would you ever want to use them? Just don't use them. I, I mean, I'm using them now. <laughs> but they were the only mercenaries available, so. Interesting they sallied out, though. Oh, the one good thing is that they're selling out of their own city. Peasants, you stand at the front. Take any, take the brunt of the blow. Numidians behind. Slingers. Oh, look at that range. It is horrendous. Uh, Bedouin and general guys, you go here. You guys here. What are you? Okay, peasants. Go on then. Let's watch these camels in action. Who's next out? Skirmishers, pointless to send these guys out together. They're sending their main bulk of the army around that side, which is literally pointless. I don't know what they're doing. Look how slow they are. The one thing here is that we've got to watch out for those towers. They're going to shoot our general to pieces. Get these guys killed, as many of them as possible. Right, back. Okay, now we need to turn and face. About turn, my friends. Um, in fact, I'd probably keep the skirmishers on the side. You guys actually come and try and harass this general. Oh, it's both the generals together. Oh, lovely. Thank you. Okay, more peasants. See, like, what is the AI doing? Like, 
if they charge those generals through here, they will do what we just did. Basically route everyone. <laughs> Uh, you can fire at will because there's no one else here. And keep the general in close proximity because he has to be. Is he getting shot? I don't think he's. Don't believe he's getting shot by the towers, which is great. If you want to chase that camel, please be my guest. You run into my skirmisher fire. Uh, I'll take you off to skirmish mode. You guys as well. Come on, fire guys! Good God, you're slow. God, stupid rebels. I'll bring them around for another shot by the uh, skirmishers. Okay, actually, we'll charge in the back of them here. It should do some damage and try and get out. Oh my god, the Bedouin archers are trash. Now just run through them, why don't you? They've lost hardly anyone. Okay, get in there. Guys, get around this way. Try and charge. You're just too slow, camels. Do you hear what I'm saying? You guys chase them down. You get through the gate if you can. Okay, we're going to have to get our general out of there very soon. Oh, rebel general's fleeing already. I don't know how. Are the rebel generals just trash compared to our generals? Yeah, get into them. Was that my general? Yeah, okay, good. Get forward, infantry! My big infantry boys! My peasants! The peasants will assault the town! Let's go! Kill those bowmen. Oh, if we could break everyone at the same time, we will win. We won't be able to do that, though. Guys, get forward! Come on, peasants, you are too slow. Come through. Okay, yep. Get through, peasants. We'll take the gateway. Let's speed it up now. Peasants, come on. Why are you so slow? Why are you so slow? Jesus. Come on. What the hell? Okay, the gate's closed now. Get out, General. Bedouins. You guys. Anyone wants to... Ow! Oh, this has been a disaster. Come on. Stupid. How did the gate close? Okay, those peasants can die. They are idiots. It's their fault. Fucking idiots. I'm glad they're all dead. Come on. Oh, what are you doing? I'm not going to siege you down, you fucking idiots. But they keep breaking, look. Oh, what do we have here? Kill as many as you can, bro. How have we not taken the gateway, then? Draw them out. Oh my god, we can just do it with these camels, it looks like. They can't break on the town square, so bring them out. Uh, will you come through? How? How can you... You can open this gate, come on. Apparently you can't, you fools. What are you? Kill them. I think we're going to have to charge them on the square. They are just peasants there, but they will beat the camels. <laughs> That's how trash these camels are. Uh, can we find them, please? They're like, where are they? Get out, get out, get out! They'll break now. Oh. Alright, we'll break them and kill as many as we can. Yeah, go, 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 go. Yes! That's it, bro. These five Bedouins can do it. If the five Bedouins can do it, anyone can do it. Are you listening at home, guys? 
The five Bedouin uh, camel warriors can do this. Take the whole city of Thebes. Oh, God, one died in the assault. Jesus. Ah, oh, fools. Fools. I don't know how we didn't take the gate then when the Bedouin horses went through. This is what you get, Thebes, for rebelling. I'm sorry. Well, I'm not actually sorry. Uh, you're in Memphis. That's poor. I don't want you in Memphis. Um, oh well, make your long walk up here. We might use you in the uh, in the thing. Rioting, Eretium. They're actually okay now. Don't be so upset with us. Ceasefire, yep. Death stalks the land. Oh, Jesus, Sardis. Worst possible place for it, to be honest. Yeah, I was going to say, can't afford for all these troops to die. But they're going to. Oh, well. We'll just have to wait a few more turns before those armies get brought into action. Yeah, race is held everywhere because we need them. Arsakia. Let's do this construction as quick as we can, really. Susa. It's just everywhere is constructing and building things now. It's redonkulous. Artaxata. Yep. Hatra. Tyus. Hatcher is a little town at the start of the game. I guess that one got upgraded pretty quickly. Campus Sarmatai. Tarsus. Hmm. Tarsus, we actually want you for horses, maybe. 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 <laughs> so that's Jerusalem. Nope. Ship. Halicarnassus. Be interesting to see how much money we have at the end of this. Uh, we have over a million now, but how much will we have right at the end? Probably an absolutely obscene amount. Right, Masana, actually. Law, please. Bylazora. Law. All these new places we've taken. Kuroton. Get these. They're really good buildings. Horolism. We're going to keep Antioch as our capital as well, because we are the successor to Antiochus. Of course. Even if we are Parthia. But we're going to frame ourselves that way. I know it's probably sacrilege to Parthians out there. But I'm sorry. Uh, get up there. Killing those guys. Our Quincum, we probably could have taken that. Tavium. Trash settlement. Trash garrison. We're going to smash those guys. Uh, Suggesta. Ah, oh, this is annoying. We're probably not going to be able to take Suggesta, even though it's a minor city because of those guys. Might be able to knock down the gates, actually. You have. They do have stone walls. Ah, that is annoying. Oh, well. Ooh, could do another try and do another draw out battle. Mighty General. A bit easier than trying to assault them with this army on the horizon. Sire. Hmm. Yes. Right. First things first. Sire. Oh, no. Let's get these ones out of the way. How is that balance of power calculated? It's silly. That's a silly, silly balance of power. Redonkulous, some people would say. They do not understand the power of the horse archer. Hmm. Um. Yeah. I don't know. Weird. Very weird. This is an army hiding outside now the city. Is the time for battle. Pull on your armor. They generally, yes, genuinely have two troops. Like what? What? What are they thinking? Putting that balance of power out there. We'll be able to do this with just our general. Hope they have their archers at the front so we can just shoot them. They do have towers, so we've got to be wary of that. But, uh, 
Eastern Infantry, I don't care about losing you, so you go forward. You guys get there, I don't think you'll lose. Uh, we'll get you. Uh, they're just going to hide in the town centre, aren't they? The fools. Alright, speed this up then. Um, do we go shoot them? I just can't be bothered. I think we're going to charge them. They'll probably move. Normally they do move to the gates when the someone's attacking the gates. Go shoot them with the archers. That'll draw them out. Nice. Work. Your soldiers have broken the enemy gates. You guys go there, actually. The Same with the Send you guys. Take the rest of the I believe we'll be able to shoot them very quickly. And you. The enemy walls you get there. Hoplites want you there, blocking the way. And Eastern Infantry, you there. Just so we've got somewhere to shoot at them. I want to draw them out. Okay, they're coming. They can come if they want. What are you? Oh, chosen archer war band. We'll, we'll go through you like butter. You are quite good, but we should smash them. Out. In. Out. In. Oh, that was a good charge. Kill him. I hope that's not my goal. The enemy general was a fool. Kill them all. You guys get up there. Get our archers. Our archers have to be really close to actually shoot them. They don't have great range. That's why you need long range missiles on archers. Oh, wait. They should be able to fire out. No. No, they can't. You guys. It's annoying having to do these small battles, you know. When we're so far down the campaign. But auto resolving this would have been a huge amount of losses. Um, uh, you guys come here. If they want to come out, they can do. Yep, there they come. Okay, General, let's go. Yep, nice. Sorted. Sped it up a little bit. <laughs> Fantastic. Another German settlement in our hands. wonder how big Germania is. I would like to do a toggle fog of war at some point, but it's cheating basically, Victory isn't it now? Is ours, 9,000 people Victory dead. Another toll of schools to our name. Unfortunately, in the name of the great party of empire, but the enlightenment that will come their way they do not know of it. Mighty they cannot general. speak of it. Oh. I was going to say, yeah, it's time to get the elephants in action, but actually not. This is... Uh, it's annoying fighting these small battles, but what can you do? Auto-resolve would just result in loads of troops dying. We don't want that. Especially these good troops. Um, Hoplites, you can go for the gate because you're not going to get shot. Archers, you go there. We have long range missiles with these guys, which is excellent. So you can like go there and still fire, can't you? Our two generals, they'll smash those warband fools into oblivion. Also have a very nice map for... That's the gateway. I'm going to go for that wall, actually. Okay, they're going to do the same thing. Run. They can run. Let them run. The general will deal with them. It's a very nice map, this one, for using horse archers inside a city. There are no real nice maps for using horse archers in the cities, but as maps go, this is probably the best one. This barbarian type settlement where you can just put them there and you don't have any pathing issues. Your soldiers have broken the enemy gates. Thank you, my friend. Units, double side. Go there. General, 
The cowardly General. enemy have lost the wall. Uh, send your quick, troops please. and take the rest of the settlement. The cowardly enemy cannot hide. You have breached the walls. Get around Begin that way, guys. Let's see, this is silly. Let's go. Just run around. Generals. Go. Who did that also? Did we get we grab the hopper days? Uh, you guys get over that way, please. Whoops, we lost a few troops there by accident. We should be able to just kill them now. Oh. Get out, get out, General. Oh. Yeah, sorted. We lost 33. More than we needed to. We could have just ran them around, but in the interest of sanity and speed, um, we, <laughs> we won't drag these battles out longer. Like in the early game, I would have dragged that out as long as I could, but not in this one. It's a large town, so we can't retrain these guys. This is a city, though. Apparently we can retrain these guys. I don't know whether that's just for an armor upgrade though, so um, we'll keep you, get you, you retrained, and then I think it is an armor upgrade. We'll recruit normal horse archer. We need to recruit normal horse archers here to try and build that army up again. And we need peasants here. As many peasants as we can get. Fire! Quincom, oh, it's just a general. They killed 60. Are you joking me? Stupid Dacia. Fools! And it's just a town, so we can't even recruit the horse archers. Oh, good lord. What uh, people can we get here then? Oh, no. Luckily, we can get one of you guys. You stand there, and the rest of you, let's go. 65%, so we'll definitely be okay. Uh, we just need to build that temple, and we'll be good. Right, next one, Suggester, you're, you're going there for Suggester. You can come for love of them, then. Uh, you're going up there. I believe, is that, that's Dacian? So that's not even German yet. Germania's not really had a brilliant game looking at it. You guys have just moved. You need to move. Um, and I think we'll siege these guys out, you know. It's only seven turns. Uh, but yeah, I believe they will sally out, which will be great for us. Uh, we could break the siege and go for Captain Augustus. I think we need to. Like, look how damaged those guys are. Oh, they ran. Ah, foolish. Ah, dear. What do we have? Archers. Well, they're not really wall-assaulting type of people, are they? Thapsus. What do you have? Not really. You do have warhounds, though. Uh, hmm. What type of walls? Looks like normal stone walls. Hmm. Mighty general. Yeah, we've got a few infantry. Yeah, you'll be able to defend the walls, which is really annoying. I'm hoping this guy attacks us. If he attacks us, we'll be good. We will be golden. Right, I believe that's everything for this turn again, maybe? Let's end the turn, and then we'll probably end the thingy there. A German merchant. Why don't you come and have a look at Bret the Bretons and see whether they're uh, doing any well. Any well? Any good. Okay, we're moving Let some us ships. end the bloodshed. <laughs> Julie, I... Uh, you need to give me... You do have a lot of regions, actually. You've got some in Spain, but yeah, we're not bothered about destroying you completely. Like to, can you give me Patavium and Medialanium? That's all I need. And Suggester. I will give you 
30,000. How does that sound? Very demanding. Regretfully, we must decline. It looks like they were they were they would have accepted an offer with with money though. But oh well. Dear friend. Ah, cool. Ah. Uh, Go on, Our just friend. for the memes. Welcome, friend. Show me your map information, just because I want to see a most generous proposal. where you guys are. I hate that it closes the map during the end turn. Please can you Let not us do end that? The bloodshed. Germania! <laughs> oh, no. Until next time. Everyone's scared of us now, which is interesting. Okay. That's a silly decision, my friend. Have mercy. So they will become our protectorate, but no. Until we will destroy time. you. You only have two settlements left, stupid Dacia. Cool. Africa. Yeah, I don't care about merchants. Sorry. Faction announcement. Tabor of Babylon. Yes, this man took Thebes back. Ah, we didn't even... Uh, look at what we were building there uh, also were we able to retrain any of these guys oh yes we were fantastic so we should have an easy time there this army needs to get going uh, yep yeah, they are happy now it's so easy to make them happy but just <laughs> if you exterminate them it's ridiculous uh, we don't need to worry about these guys um, which way you're gonna go okay, go that way Walking through the forest is dangerous. We might get ambushed, but oh well. You guys move that way. You guys move up. I hope they sally out of that, because that's going to be annoying otherwise. You guys get to Suggesta. Suggestica. Sorry, not Suggesta. Uh, yes, Carthage. The big army. Where's that big army gone then? Is that it? I don't think so. How many turns for Carthage? Seven. Mm. Seven as well. Gonna have to get some uh, mercenary infantry, I believe. Hoplites and you guys. You can man the rams and stuff. Okay, they're stuck there now, which is fine. Uh, well, we just need ladders. I actually might just use that just four ladders. Uh, I believe we'll be able to assault the walls then. You guys, your replacements, mercenary captain. Right, we'll do the construction, get it out of the way. Mazakar, big Damascus, that Nicomedia, that Sardis. So, ooh. Get that. Thessalonica. That lovely Kydonia. Some archer rangers. Sparta. Sparta. Hmm. Shipwrights. Larissa. Athens. I don't know why we're getting mines, but we are. Okay. More wealth. Byzantium. That Tylus. That. Tarentum, that, Araminum, that, Aretium, Temple, 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 Syracuse, Temple, Lycus Gothi, Temple, Aquincum, nothing, Aretium, yep, Aquincum is trash. So, next, okay, you have some great uh, traits, nine influence, fantastic. So, next. So, this turn, what do we have to do next episode? Uh, we have to take Thapsus. I'm not going to attack Lily by him. I'm surprised they're not sallying out. Probably because we've got elephants in the army. Um, but yeah. Okay. Um, so, Jester, they don't sally out. I don't, oh, don't want to go whole six turns. We'll do the same. We'll get some mercenary infantry. But yeah, we'll take Patavium. We'll take Suggesta. We'll sally out of Vicus Gothi. Or Vicus Gothi, if you're going to say it in the uh, Roman way. 
or goth eye, I believe. Goth, uh, no, goth eve. Yeah, goth eve. I, oh look, Breton. So Germania is pretty trash. Looks like they have these settlements and that's it. Trash Germania. Oh, it's going to be annoying taking these settlements down here when we do the uh, world conquest. But, you know, we're pretty much majorly across the map. Gaul is basically now Spain. <laughs> so Gaul is Spain. Germania only has five settlements left. Oh, six maybe, unless that's... I don't know whether that's... That, no, those are hangovers. So Spain, uh, Gaul has four. Uh, Julii there, Germania. Once we've taken these two, we, these three regions and these two, I believe we can, and these three, we can call that, you know, game over. And then we'll do our, our, uh, our uh, live stream. That's the word for it. <laughs> Fantastic. All right, guys. Well, thank you very much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Hopefully I'll see you again on the next video.